I've always wondered about the possibility of using this little creek for hydropower. Today I'm going to do some quick and dirty tests to see if we've got enough flow to make it worth our while. The roots here have formed a sort of waterfall, as you can see. And I'm going to see if I can clear it out a little bit and use it to do my flow test. Okay, I went back to the house and I found this cook pot, which is just a little over a gallon. So what I'm going to do is throw my handy gallon pot under this water and wait for it to fill up. Once I know how many seconds it takes to fill up the gallon pot, I can calculate how many gallons, of min gallons per minute of flow we have in this creek. All right, it's going in. That took two seconds. All right, now let's do some math. Now let's say it took three seconds for one gallon. It might have taken two seconds. The creek right now is kind of medium height. It does get a lot lower than this though, and it even dries up in really dry weather. So being a little conservative is a good idea. And we all know there's 60 seconds in a minute. Cancel out those seconds. You get 60 gallons in three minutes, which of course is the same as 20 gallons per minute. And we like to abbreviate that 20 GPM. So that's our flow. by the Avian Aquamizer, our poop-free chicken water. Visit us on the web at www.avianaquamizer.com.